Hi everybody! Oh, so we're in American Fort Canyon right now. It's the day before Father's Day and we decided to take the kids and go on a little hike and we're coming down but I'll show you the views that we just saw at the very top. Sorry I keep looking down. This is a little steep. But enjoy the views that we just saw. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side our fears are done. Oh, the good times just begun. Um, we know what we have, let's hold on tight. Found what we're looking for in life. We've got the boys here. There's Woody and his kids. This is so pretty. I don't remember the name of this trail. But there's like these open meadows and it gets pretty steep. Oh, there's a hole that I just stepped in. How you doing, babe? Good. How you doing, kids? Which way should we go? Looks like we well, came from that way, but allegedly it loops around to the same parking lot this way. Let's go that way. Okay. On an adventure. Hopefully. Hopefully it's not a catastrophe. What's that hiking technique, Chris? Yeah. Minecraft. <laughs> Do you think we can drink out of that? No. Oh. This is anyway skin. Apparently this is a horse trail. There's a nice little spring down here. There's so many pretty wildflowers out here. These ones are like orange and blue. There's a butterfly. I stopped to record for one second and they're already almost not visible. So I guess I'll just enjoy the scenery by myself. I'm kind of disappointed in myself, honestly, because this hike has kicked my butt I'm super out of breath, which just means I need to hike more. But I'm not used to being the last one for being this out of breath. Quarantine really takes it out of you, huh? I don't know if you guys can hear it, but the leaves in the trees is like one of my favorite sounds. The wind blowing through the leaves on the trees. One of these things is not like the other. It's one purple flower out in the middle of nowhere. Where do you think that goes? That goes to... Oh. Trump. Zero five two. <laughs> nice. They're real original with their names. Nice and creative, huh, babe? Yeah. Hopefully this takes us back. Where's the caterpillar? Are you gonna be able to oh, pinpoint it? Oh, you did. Wow. Anyone know what kind of caterpillar this is? It's got like it's black and furry with yellow spots. Oh, that one's big. Mm -hmm. Do you think those are the kind that turn into monarch butterflies? I the think they're the kind that are poisonous. Yellow and black butterflies? Yeah, think Aren't I butterflies think poisonous? Like... Some can be, I think. Man, I the things you think you know. Chris just made an awesome discovery. Those are mushrooms. What does it look like, babe? Looks like a butt. <laughs> I want to see it like underneath. I touched the butt. <laughs> you touched the butt. Pull these down. I want to see the stems. Yeah, they're under there. Whoa, anyone know what kind of mushrooms those are? Those are huge. 
We did it. We made it. Only sort of. Hi. I didn't trip it off. <laughs> Should we start a new thing called like the trail scale or something? Where you rate the trail? Yeah, it was an R and R. On a oh gross. <laughs> on a scale from one to ten. Ready, go. Like how hard it was or no, just how like cool it was. How much you liked it. Nine. It's a solid eight. Yeah. Eight Kay. and a half. Eight and a half? I'd say I'd say a nine. It was really awesome. It was eight and one cent. <laughs> it was really pretty to see how green it was and we saw some really cool mushrooms and caterpillars and anyway. And now we get to sit in the hot car. Yeah, now we're gonna get in the hot car, but we'll pick this up tomorrow because we have another fun adventure for Father's Day that we can't talk about yet because the kids don't know what it is. And we're surprising them. And you're gonna like it, right? Uh huh. <laughs> Good answer. Okay, see you tomorrow. Oh, we know what we have. Let's hold on tight. Just kidding. It's not tomorrow yet, but we pulled off the side of the road. Oh, my back felt sweaty too. We pulled off the side of the road because there's this pretty river that we wanted to enjoy. Is the water cold? Okay, now we're, we'll really see you tomorrow. Side side and through and through No limit to what we can do Hi guys! It's Father's Day today. Woo. It's the next day. Here's the Hi. father. I'm the father's today. Here's the Hellions that oh, made him a father. And today we're going kayaking. With some blow up kayaks that we rented out on this very pretty lake. Does this lake have a name, do you know? Lost Lake. Lost Lake. But we found it, so. So it's not lost anymore. <laughs> but, um, okay. Woody's got one done. These are actually two person kayaks. The seats are right there. They just clip in. And then the oars. And like I said, we've never been kayaking before, so this is gonna be fun. The water's pretty cold. We're just gonna eat some lunch and then get out on the water. Um, babe, huh? babe, I'm being cast out to like. <laughs> I am so <soaking> No! <laughs> it's a nice view, babe. Your wallet's about to fall out of your pocket, I feel like, any time now. Man. Through that hole. Is that how you lost the $500? Oh, maybe. Why are you gonna bring that up? Yeah, why do you have to bring that up? So one time, we went to Hawaii, and we were going deep sea fishing, and it was really early in the morning, we had to get up at like 4.30, and then we had to walk to the dock, and we got cash to pay for it, because it's cheaper when you pay in cash, and we couldn't find the, the cash anywhere. We thought we left it in the hotel room. Well, six hours later, when we got back, after Woody caught this huge, what kind of, an Ono fish, right? Yeah. We rushed back to the hotel room, couldn't find the $500, so pretty sure it fell out of his pocket while we were walking to the dock. And we didn't even get to try the fish because we were so sad and it sucks losing $20. Well, that was a lot of money, okay. huh babe? Yeah, it was. Anyway, actually, moral of the story is careful with carrying around cash, I guess, right? Yep. Or don't let Woody hold any cash. Life. I'm having a great time. Javen's doing all the work now. Good job, Javen. You're doing great.
doesn't know this, but we're coming camping. Well, she knows we're coming camping in a couple of weekends. And we're gonna hike that big, beautiful thing because I'm fairly certain that gap in the snow is the trail and we can make it up. Well, that was fun. My pants got soaked the second time around and so Woody gave me his pants. They don't fit so well, but that's okay. I had okay. shorts underneath, Because so. he had shorts. True gentleman, huh, babe? Anyway, did you have fun? Yeah. Did you boys have fun? Mm-hmm. It was lots of fun. I had lots of fun, too. My first time kayaking. Worth noting that the elevation at Lost Lake is about 8,500. 9,000 feet, so the water is super cold. But it was pretty cold. We actually saw some people paddle boarding and they had a dog on front of their paddle board, which is always super cute. All right, guys, we're gonna end this one here. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. I s Whoa, that zoomed in. Try to figure it out alone